A lot of communities are crying out for this. They're saying we don't have anything for our young people, a gathering space, a place where they can take classes and, and learn new skills and get together, get to know each other and work on really positive projects. And that's what Artsville is. We are, as an arts and cultural center in the city of Cincinnati, we're new. Um, and we've had to find our way in this world uh, in terms of how do we navigate the arts and the culture. Artsville, you know, I would pass by it and wonder, I wonder what happens in Artsville. And so I was really happy when, when Miss Garrison invited me here for a tour. Every day we find people who, well, I don't know what goes on in the building. We don't know what you're doing in there. Um, and once they find out, they're back. They come back. Artsville has provided that opportunity too to bring arts programming into a community that brings kids together, some that have arts programming and some that don't. And so it's, it's really unique in that way. The creative needs that Artsville has fulfilled here in Madisonville I think are exponential, uh, both inside the building and outside. Um, one of the things that always comes to mind for me, uh, being the parent of a seven-year-old, um, is the outstanding creative opportunities that our young people have to create and explore uh, through STEM art projects, uh, through hands-on trainings and initiatives. Um, they're able to really tap into their artistic outlets. And it's a place for young people from Madisonville, and really all over the city, but especially from Madisonville, to come and learn new skills and come together and do, do really positive things. And that's so important. Every community needs something like Artsville. Artsville, I think they make everybody feel like they're a part of this community. This is the place that you can call home. This is a place that you will be welcomed, uh, and you'll be free to express your creativity in the best ways possible. When we took over this building, um, we knew that there was going to be a lot of work uh, in the building because it had not been utilized for several years. We had to replace everything that had been stripped from the building sound system, chairs, all of those things. The building is beautiful, so I went upstairs, well first I saw the artwork on the walls down here, and then I saw the fantastic studio upstairs, and I mean, this is just wonderful. Artsville just is a real, a real jewel to this community, so I, I'm really happy to see that it keep, things keep improving, and I hope that continues. We've got some pretty substantial things that need to be done in the building. The third floor, is probably one of the most valuable spaces that we have. Uh, currently it is being utilized for storage, but we can envision and see uh, artists, whether that's a performing artist or whether that's a paint studio up there, that's valuable space. Support, I think, will only help um, increase that visibility, um, both here in the city and outside as Artsville continues to grow. We are so looking forward to be able to provide that kind of service to community and to the artist, um, but we need your help in getting that done. So uh, when you think about where those dollars are going to go, Artsville uh, is where we need you.